Hey folks, this is Jake Davis from the On The Fly Review for you. And today I'm talking about Furiosa Mad Max Saga, released um, uh, a few weeks ago. Um, directed by George Miller, starring Chris Hemsworth and Anya Taylor-Joy. The whole set of this movie, this is a prequel to Mad Max Fury Road. Uh, the whole story is about a young Fury Ro Furiosa, uh, how she was stolen from her family, forced into slavery, uh, and mutilated by this evil man named Dementis, basically getting her in her starting position, working for Mortem Joe at the Citadel in Fury Road. Um, now, granted, this was something Miller said he wanted to do like 10 years ago. Uh, he said he wanted to eventually come back to uh, Furiosa's story and do a prequel about her down the line. Um, I liked this movie. I thought it was a you know, passable action film. I one thing I criticize about it, I think I would have liked a lot more of. Oh my gosh, she's so she's so fucking. I don't know. She's been telling me about uh, some kind of mythic battle between Pikachu and Tails. She's nuts. But <laughs> but I didn't like the visual effects in this movie, and I, like I said, I would like a lot more for uh, more of Mortem Joe going into more of his evil, his backstory. And a little bit more about the Citadel itself. Um, but the reason to see this movie is just a phenomenal performance oh, from Chris you. Hemsworth. He is really fantastic in this movie. Probably the, probably the best performance he's, he's given yet. Uh, I'm giving this movie, because uh, I did have problems with it. Um, I did want, I did walk, I did leave wanting. You know, I mean, um, I expected more, I guess. Uh, I give the film four stars. I give three and a half stars. Still a good movie. Still recommend the film. Uh, but I did prefer Fury Road. Uh, none of them are as good as The Road Warriors. I've said before, I think The Road Warriors is the best sequel in movie history. Uh, um, yeah. Recommended, but still kind of disappointing. I'm Jake Davis, and I'll catch you on the fly.